Hi everyone, Project Pig here and welcome to the Journal of a Project Professional. Hope everyone's doing really fantastic and ready for another journal entry. Vlog number nine, planning for success. One really important aspect of management is planning. No matter what context you think about management in. So my monthly drumbeat dictates a regular pattern split between delivery focus at the front end of the month followed by more general team focus and activity completion during the back end of the month. Although the intensity and variety of activities will vary month on month, of course. In the business I work in, we work around the financial year, which in the UK is April through to March. Therefore, January is the time to start putting together your your plans get that strategic thinking in place ready for the next April to come so this raises a number of questions who are we as a group what are our, obje our, our objectives what do we want to achieve in the next 12 months is the team organization still appropriate from what it was previously are the skills and knowledge mix in the team the best blend for success what's the funding strategy for the team and what are the customers' in expectations? And those could be internal or external customers, but most importantly, the customer comes at the front. Strategic thinking brings so many questions, but the answers are not always so clear. But clarity itself is an enabler for success. In my experience, if people have clarity, they'll feel much more secure and therefore more likely to achieve their own potential. This is the basis of Maslow's hierarchy of needs, a model based on core principles of human psychology, therefore just as relevant today as it was when it was first devised 100 years ago, which is amazing when we think about it. Technology moves so far forward, things that couldn't have even been imagined 100 years ago, but our basic psychology stays the same. This is why it's so important that we write down our strategy and our plans, make things clear for people, make them explicit, and provide clarity for all. So take time to reflect on the present and plan for the future. The next 12 months horizon is always a good start. Write things down and make it available to the team. If necessary, talk them through it and the thoughts and reasons behind it. It's the least we must do as leaders. Please don't forget to subscribe, it's free after all. Just press the subscribe button below. And why not give us a like? Or maybe share with others. By the way, do you know about projectpointhub.com, the parent site that I have, where you can connect with other professionals, graduates, students alike, and utilize the many great resources available to support you in your P3M journey. And as we do so, thinking about social and environmental sustainability of our people and our planet. There's loads of great resources on there. We have blogs, vlogs, and peer-to-peer messaging. There's a, there's a library of documents to upload and download, CPD logs, loads of fantastic things for you to use and enjoy. Big thanks to you all out there for watching and listening. It really is appreciated. This would not be possible without you. Speak again soon.